Well, the president will be making his third visit to the UW-Madison campus this week. Political reporter Jessica Arp tells us about the debate over why he'll be stopping here in tonight's campaign 2012 coverage. Well, this will be the president's first stop following the presidential debate in Denver Wednesday night. Some say to draw a huge crowd. Others say because he may be in trouble in Wisconsin. The Obama campaign says the president will speak Thursday afternoon on Bascom Mall, both to discuss his plans for a second term, but also to encourage supporters to vote early. Republicans charge it's because the president has a, quote, Wisconsin problem and is making two stops in two weeks because of concern over GOP momentum. I could see why they would say that. I think that's their job to say that, but I think they know that that's probably wrong simply because the president's surging in the polls here in Wisconsin because of a lot of hard work that a lot of people throughout the state have done. If anything, I think he's coming here to seal the deal and, and to you know close the door on, on uh, Wisconsin and, and make sure that Democrats win. Obama was last in Madison in September of 2010, rallying supporters on Library Mall for Democratic candidates for governor and U.S. Senate. In a statement, Romney campaign spokesman Ben Sparks said it's clear the president is acknowledging a problem, saying, quote, after winning the state by 14 points in 2008, President Obama obviously sees the writing on the wall that Wisconsin is poised to go red in November. Obama supporters, of course, refute that, saying instead that Madison is a location where they can draw a huge crowd and use the platform to encourage early voting, which helped the president significantly in Wisconsin in 2008. It will be busy. Thank you, Jessica.